Okay, let me uh, make that alert into a real time, guys. Let us check. So I'll get select star from uh, novel auto loader. Let me do this and see what all column names I have, and I'll start inserting some records into that table. So yes, I can see that uh, there are almost six records. If you want, uh, we can make it in a real time, like pulling a data in from our raw container into the same table. We can do that. Uh, but now, okay, what we will do, guys, uh, if you remember in the auto loader section, we have created, uh, like we have inserted two records now. So now let me go back to my Azure account. Let me do a quick check on this Databricks Exaware where I have stored all my data into the containers. Let me check in the raw container. I have a directory called as an input input stream, I guess input stream. Yeah, I got two files pub and jan. Let me check whether these files are same or not. Yeah, these files are same. These are files are same. Uh, we will do it by auto loader or maybe copy into both will work. Okay, both will work. So I'll drop a March file guys. Now I'll drop one March file. So let me check how the March file looks like. Yeah, this is something else. Let me open this. Yeah, this is a March file. Now we are not changing a schema and all that thing guys. So let me upload the March file manually. Yeah, so let me upload it now. I should see four, uh, three or four more records now. And let me come back to my query uh, where I use the copy into. So let me go back. Yeah, this is my copy into. Let me pull this here. Yeah, let me run this copy into also. Copy into. Okay, so this is my uh, other table. Let me pick up the auto loader table auto loader table and it's inside the databricks raw input stream input stream and now i said merge schema let me run this and check what i'll get yeah it got executed i guess beautiful it got executed let me go and select the table guys now Yeah, so it got executed. You can see 10 rows got added. Now I need to see uh, how. Yeah, now you can see you got uh, like, OK, some rows have been copied in double. I'll tell you why. The reason is we uh, we drop that file and we have uploaded it again. So that's the reason why uh, it has copied two times. So but we have achieved that we got 16 rows now let me go back to alerts and see what is happening here mm. in the first alerts my value count okay let me go to the dashboard first dashboard and i need to refresh this right i need to click on refresh and see what has happened now yeah oh i got some bad records i guess let me go back and see the query first. 